Hey, what's up everyone? I hope that you're having an amazing day today. I am making some grilled corn and avocado salsa, which is going to be going on top of some beautiful grilled ahi, and it's going to be so super stupid delicious. I hope that you check it out, and hey, let's rock it out. Okay, so the first thing that I need to do is get a couple of things on the grill. So I have my lovely corn, and what I'm going to do with this is just really simply brush it with a sesame seed oil, and you can use whatever kind you want. I personally like black sesame, but totally up to you. And then I have my beautiful tuna, and you can use like red snapper would be good, swordfish would be good, whatever kind of fish that like you're into. I'm not going to season them before I put them on the grill. I'm just going to give them a little brush of canola oil because the teriyaki sauce that I'm going to put onto them has a ton of salt in it already, so it doesn't really need that extra salt put onto it. So just a little brush of canola oil and onto the grill. So this is gonna be my brush of oil. It's not a brush. Flip it. Spray it. These are going to go onto the grill and then I'm going to go ahead and put some teriyaki sauce onto them as they cook. Sesame oil and onto the grill with the corn. Okay, so the next thing that I'm going to do is chop up two green onions. So what I like to do is just take the ends off and kind of get them out of the way like so. And then like chop there, chop there, and then kind of stack these together like that, right? Give them a little, get them evened up. And then... All right, put those in a nice little pile. All right, okay. Got this guy to deal with. I'm just gonna chop him there, chop this like this. And for like this part, chop off the little end, get rid of that, chop it into halves, and then you're gonna go one this way, like this. Green onion chopped, right? Gorgeous. This is going over to the side in my bowl. It's a bowl of magic. It's where I keep my green onions, this is my bowl of magic. Where do you keep your green onions? You have a bowl of magic. Okay, so we're gonna start to assemble our salsa, right? So the first thing that you're going to need is the rest of the sesame oil that you didn't use on the fish which is going to be like, I don't know, two teaspoons. We'll say two teaspoons. Uh, this is rice wine vinegar. We're going to call that about a tablespoon. Yeah. Ish. Some ginger. About a teaspoon. Yummy. Boop, boop, boop. Garlic. About a teaspoon. Going in. Ching! Make a wish. Here you go. Some green onion that we chopped up lemon zest got some shallots shallots beautiful gorgeous shallots going in I also have some mango I'm gonna put it in there so the next thing that I'm going to add in is some shurikake furikake if you want to do it with an American accent but like it's a combination of black sesame seeds it's got salt in it it has a little bit of seaweed flakes right some bonito what's up a little bit of sorchacha do it to your likeness we're gonna stir this up okay we got that all mixed up corn came off the grill right beautiful it's gorgeous right so not all fancy. I know y'all can get out like your bun cake pans or whatever you're gonna do so it doesn't go everywhere but I'm just gonna like cut it off with my chef knife because that's reasonable. Okay so we're gonna take all of that lovely grilled corn right and we're gonna move it to the bowl. Move it to the bowl. So there it is all inside of my bowl and I'm gonna go ahead and give it a nice a mix around all gorgeous. I think that's pretty much it, except I want to close the bowl because looking at you. I'm going to taste it. Can I have a fork, please? Yeah, you can. 
fork, yeah. Fork, yeah. Mm -hmm. Ooh. There it is, yummy. Mmm, 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 mmm. Oh my god, it's so good. You know what, though, seriously? Do we have a lime? Like, do we own a lime right now? I just threw away our key lime. Mmm. I'm gonna put it like a touch of lemon. It's gonna make it perfect. Did I gonna put like an acid in this or what? It's always better than that. If the <laughs> Taste it again. Mmm. Mmm, God. Mmm, mmm, mmm. My God, who made that? It's friggin' delicious. I'm not kidding. I can eat this by itself. Okay, so now it is time to plate up. What I have going on here is my beautiful ahi tuna with a little bit of arugula underneath. And you always want to dress your greens just because it looks prettier. That's the idea, right? A little bit of oil of any kind, salt and pepper, dress your greens. Next, I'm going to add a little bit of that beautiful salsa that we just made, the corn, avocado, mango yumminess. I haven't entirely decided how I want to do it, but I think it's going to go like this. Oh, that's sexy. <laughs> came out sexy, right? Do a little, oh. I think it needs a little another, oh. Uh. That's gorgeous. I'm not going to touch it. Don't touch it. Right? And you know what? Like, I've been visiting with my parents, right? So I've been in this high food kind of mood. So I got some peanuts. What? Peanuts. Oh, gosh. Do you want to go sideways or here? Let's start here. That is freaking sexy. Right there. Ooh. You guys ready? Our temperature looking like Xavier. Mm. Xavier grilled these. Mm, mm -mm. So I took a big bite. I'm sorry. Oh my goodness, it's so good. It is so freaking good. You have like tanginess from the ginger and like the lemon. Mm mm. It's like smooth from the avocado and like there's so much going on in this bite. It is delicious. And you should have some. Going in for bite two. Is that good? Is that freaking good? Arugula, peppery, mango, sweet. Uh, got some on my pinky. What? <laughs> that matter is delicious. You guys absolutely have to try this recipe. It's stupid good. Hey, I'll see y'all in the next video. Happy cooking, everyone. Backbite forever.com. Oh my gosh.